Once upon a time, a blue bird lived in a nest beneath a large people tree. She had called this place home for many years. One day, the blue bird flew away in search of food. She ventured to a distant corn field and stayed there for quite a few days. While the bird was away, a rabbit discovered her empty nest and decided to make it his new home. When the bird came back, she was surprised and upset to see the rabbit living in her nest. She asked the rabbit to leave, but the rabbit said that since she hadn't been around for a long time, the nest was now his home. The bird and the rabbit argued loudly, and soon, other animals and birds gathered to watch. They listened to both sides of the story, but they couldn't decide who was right. They suggested that the bird and the rabbit should take their problem to a judge. So, the bird and the rabbit set off on a journey to find a judge. They traveled a long way and finally arrived at the banks of the Ganges River. In the distance, they saw a tomcat. However, they were afraid to approach him because he had a wicked reputation. But to their surprise, the tomcat had closed his eyes and was standing on his hind legs, praying loudly. This made him look holy, and the bluebird and the rabbit thought he would be a fair judge for their case. After the tomcat finished praying and opened his eyes, the bluebird explained their argument. Then, the rabbit shared his side of the story. The cat sat quietly for a moment and then said, I am quite old and my hearing and eyesight are not so good. Can you both come a little closer and repeat your story? Trusting the tomcat, the bluebird and the rabbit moved closer to him. But as soon as they were close enough, the cat attacked them with his paws, killing them both. He then had a meal out of them. And so, the bluebird and the rabbit's trust in the seemingly holy tomcat led to a tragic end for both of them. The story teaches us to be cautious and not to trust someone just because they appear to be Welcome good or back trustworthy. To our channel. Don't Today, we have an incredible story that teaches us the importance of listening to wise advice and working together. Get ready to witness the daring escape of a flock of birds from a clever hunter in our captivating tale, The Wise Birds and the Hunter's Trap. Our story takes place in the vast sky where a flock of birds soared high above the ground. Suddenly, one bird spotted a bountiful spread of grains below. Grains! There are plenty of grains down there. Let's land and feast. I'm hungry and tired. However, the leader of the birds sensed danger and attempted to caution them against hasty actions. We should not act hastily. This might be a trap set to catch us. I see no danger. Look at those delicious grains. I agree. Let's go down and enjoy the feast. Little did they know that a hunter lay hidden in a bush nearby, eagerly waiting for their arrival. I hope those foolish birds will fall into my trap. Despite the leader's warning, the birds landed and the hunter swiftly threw his net over them. Panic ensued as the birds desperately tried to escape in every direction. Oh no! We should have listened to a wise leader. We can still escape. Stop flying randomly. All of you, follow me in this direction. The birds trusted their leader and took off together, carrying the net with them. The astonished hunter watched helplessly as his catch and net flew away. I lost not only my catch but also my net. The birds flew until they reached a nearby pond where their friends, the mice, resided. We need your assistance, dear mouse friends. The mice gather around and use their sharp teeth to swiftly shred the net into pieces, setting the birds free. 
With hearts full of gratitude, the birds soared away happily, having learned the importance of heeding wise counsel and the strength that comes from unity. Remember, in the face of adversity, it is crucial to listen to those with experience and work together towards a common goal. Thank you for joining us today. In a small, peaceful house, all the mice gathered for a crucial meeting. Something was terribly wrong. Their numbers were dwindling, and each passing day brought the loss of yet another friend. They were facing a grave threat, a big, black, and cunning cat, a true killer in their midst. She moves so stealthily, we can barely hear her footsteps. Yeah, she catches us by surprise every time. It's terrifying. We need to come up with a plan to protect ourselves. The mice brainstormed ideas to outsmart the cat, desperately seeking a solution. Then, an old mouse proposed a clever plan. What if we tie a bell to her neck? The ringing will serve as a warning, alerting us to the presence of the big cat. The idea was met with unanimous approval, but there was one important question left unanswered. But who will bell the cat? I will do it. All eyes turned to Chotu, the little mouse who volunteered for the daring task. Are you sure, Chotu? It's dangerous. Trust me. I will handle it. Just get me a few bells. The mice quickly found three little bells and tied them to a pink ribbon. With their makeshift warning device ready, Chotu prepared for his mission. It's ready, Chotu. Your bravery inspires us all. Now, all you have to do is tie the ribbon to the cat. That afternoon, the cat was feeling bored and satisfied after a hearty lunch. As she admired herself in the mirror, she heard a voice. Beautiful. Undoubtedly, you are the most beautiful cat in the world. The cat's curiosity peaked, and she engaged in conversation with the tiny mouse. You seem to be a wise mouse. Wise, yes, but not as beautiful as you. How much more beautiful would I look with a necklace? Exactly. That's what I thought. Chotu presented the cat with a necklace made of bells, dazzling her with the promise of even greater beauty. Oh, how splendid! But where can I find a necklace like this? Fear not, I have brought this special necklace just for you. The cat excitedly accepts the gift and Chotu expertly ties the necklace around her neck. The mice, Watching from a safe distance, cheer and whistle as the cat proudly adorns her new accessory. For a moment, the cat's stomach is full, and her heart is filled with gratitude towards her newfound friends. The afternoon passes as the cat gazes at her reflection, enchanted by her new necklace. But soon, a rumble in her tummy reminds her of her true nature, a predator in search of a snack. To her surprise, all the mice seem to have disappeared. The cat searches every nook and cranny but finds no trace of her former prey. The mice, no longer fearful, have found solace in their bedridden guardian. Every time the cat approaches, the tinkling sound of the bell sends them scurrying for cover. She might be beautiful, but she is definitely lacking in the brains department. And so, the house remained peaceful, thanks to the cunning little mouse who outsmarted the beautiful yet not so wise cat. And that's the tale of how a few tiny bells changed everything. Remember, it's not always the biggest or the strongest who triumphs, but often the cleverest. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more captivating stories. Until next time.